Welcome back to the course. Let's see how to create micro game microvision project for our uh, nuclear development board. So for this experiment, I will be using nuclear board. That is STM32F446RE. So the procedure will be same as our microvision 51 software. So to create a new project, just go to project click on new microvision so under kale microvision so create a separate uh, workspace to store our all files so under that create new folder so let's save this project so after that the select device for target window will appear so here we have to select our microcontroller so let's select our microcontroller so this nuclear board is based on stm microelectronics so stm446 under this you have to choose this stm32 four four six r e so here is the description of the microcontroller what we have chosen next click on ok so the managed runtime environment will appear so just select your board here so we are using nucleo f four four six r e so select your board so after that add a startup file so this startup file will be available under this device option so click this startup file so after that in validation output there are some warnings so to resolve that select core from kins option so this is the kins option here you have to select core and click on OK. You can see that a project is created and all the files are added under this project test one. So under device we have two files. So one is the assembly file, other one is the C file. So the assembly file contains all vector table information of our microcontroller. And the C file consisting of some function required for application development. So these are actually called startup routines. So our new items under source group one. So here in text editor, just paste your code. So this code is a simple LED toggling code. I will explain this later. So save this file with .c extension. Let me add .c file under source group 1. Test add test1.c and close. You can see this test1.c is added under source group 1. Now compare this code, just click on build option. 
So I'll translate the file. So here uh, you have to use a LED toggling uh, um, toggling experiment. Uh, here you have to enable your LED API. So for that, go to board support and enable this LED. Yes. Okay. Build your file. So here you can see that uh, your code actually compiled without any errors. Just download the code, download the um, code into your flash memory of uh, Nucleo microcontroller. For that, you have to set your simulator. Just click this debug option. So under this, you have to select ST Link Debugger because we are using ST Link uh, Micro, that is a micro drivers, uh, uh, ST Link uh, drivers. So in settings, you click this verify code download and download to flash. Click on OK. You click OK. Compile this code. So the code is compiled successfully without any errors. Let's download the code into the flash memory of our development board. So here code is downloaded successfully. So next lecture we will see about the LED toggling program based on nuclear board. Thank you.